Back in February, Saskatchewan and NDP MP Aaron Weir was suspended from caucus following unspecified harassment allegations for the past three months. The parties conducted what they refer to as a detailed and fair investigation, but very secret about these findings. Following media reports regarding multiple complaints of harassment against Weir, the party issued a statement saying they wouldn't comment on specifics and that the report of their findings would be released shortly. However, Aaron Weir reached out to us to respond to the harassment complaint, and he now joins us from our studio in Regina. Aaron? Um, what do you make of the complaint? Why is it bogus, or is it bogus? Well, it's been a three-month investigation, and I've been very respectful of complainant confidentiality. However, the complainant uh, made their complaint uh, public today while remaining anonymous. Uh, even though the complaint was presented to me anonymously, it's clear that it's coming from a former staff member in the federal NDP uh, leader's office, who had intercepted me on my way to a microphone uh, to address a resolution at the 2016 Saskatchewan NDP convention. So this complaint really arises out of a legitimate uh, public policy uh, debate. It certainly wasn't a matter of me asserting authority over an employee. Quite the contrary, it was staff of our former uh, federal leader's office asserting their authority to shut down a debate that they deemed to be contentious. It almost sounds like you were harassed, not them. Or am I misreading that? Well, I mean, I'm certainly not uh, trying to make that claim, but it certainly was staff uh, from the leader's office uh, trying to prevent me and successfully preventing me uh, from speaking on an issue at that uh, convention. Uh, this goes back, as I said, to 2016, when Prime Minister Trudeau had announced a national price on carbon. Uh, in Saskatchewan, we were very concerned about how that might affect employment in our trade-exposed emissions-intensive industries, such as Regina's steel mill and oil refinery. I had proposed that the federal government could ensure a level playing field by extending its carbon price uh, to the carbon content of imports from countries that don't price emissions, while at the same right. time rebating that carbon price on Canadian-made uh, exports. Uh, this is an issue that I and other Saskatchewan New Democrats were keen to talk about, and the, the right. leader's office uh, didn't want us to. I've got to... Got to clear something up for me. I don't understand. So you're saying that this whole harassment allegation is based on you just trying to get a microphone. You didn't do anything confrontational. You backed down. And that's the basis for all this? Well, I mean, certainly there was a discussion on the convention floor where I uh, argued in favor of an open debate uh, on the issue. But I certainly didn't display uh, any anger or belligerence, as the complainant uh, hmm. is alleging. I mean, we were in the middle of uh, a convention floor, actually pretty close uh, to a media table. So we both had an incentive uh, to keep relatively quiet. And we were uh, quiet and respectful. Uh, but there was uh, a disagreement about how to approach this issue. And I do find it uh, troubling and inappropriate that a former senior staff person is using a harassment complaint to retaliate uh, for an MP expressing a different view on a public policy issue. All right, Aaron, we'll, we'll leave it at that. I think this story is a work in progress, but we appreciate your, uh, your insight on this at this point in time. Well, I appreciate the opportunity. Thanks for having me.